Hello, thank you for joining me. My name's Karen. Um, I wanted to talk about uh, FutureNet and uh, specifically FutureNet Cloud. So if I scroll down here, so you'll find if you scroll down FutureNet Cloud. Okay, and I just wanted to show you how you can do this. Um, so if you go into my storage, okay, and then you scroll down, and these are the different types of packages that you can buy. Okay, so you've got four gigabyte storage, um, which is um, one dollar or a hundred media points a month. Okay, which is a hundred megabytes a uh, uh, biggest file. Um, or you can go up to 10 gigabytes. That is $2.5 or 250 meter points um, a month or 20 gigapoints and so on. Okay, so basically you choose which one you want. Um, let me first explain to you the media points. So if I go back to uh, the main page, sorry, wrong one. My main page and scroll up here you can build up your media points by um, the activities that you do on FutureNet um, like buying ad packs and the matrix systems and and, um, and advertising and stuff like that okay so you can build up your media points so that is where you'll see um, how many media points that you've got okay um, so let's go back to the cloud. Okay, so we're back in the cloud here. And we're going to use our media points. So what we do is we click on media points. And then we click buy package. Okay, well, I've already bought my package. So what I'm going to do is now show you... Um, Um, my my package so let me go into my cloud so in here um, you can I can upload my files so if I go into uh, this is my cloud that I've used um, as you can see I've got two files in here, um, one that I keep my video, FutureNet videos in. Okay, and um, how you do, what you do here is basically you're just uploading files from um, your computer and, um, and you can um, upload them to whichever file that you choose. Um, if we go back into I'll show you how I did that. So, create a dictionary. Okay. So, we click on here, down here, and then you name a file. So, if we say have FutureNet um, adverts, okay, and then we create a file, and then I'll be able to put adverts in there. Okay. So, so there is my um, videos in that one that I've been downloading. So what I did was I clicked on there and then you find, um, you go into your, your documents or your videos or whatever and then you, you click on it and then you press open and it will open up. I've already opened that one up in here so I don't want to do it again. But that's basically how you download them. Okay. Um, so... create a dictionary under FutureNet you can also do that so in in my FutureNet videos I could say do sales videos or something like that and then I'll create that file within a file okay so I've got a sales um, sales videos okay so 
basically that's how you'll create them and then if we go back to our cloud teach cloud and if you want to download your files then you'll click on here okay and then you download your files okay so basically and then you've opened your file down there okay so um, I just opened that file up so I can download it again open that and then I downloaded that or you can share it or you can um, deselect all select all okay so go on to that one we can open that one okay so basically that was just to show you quickly how you can um, open FutureNet Cloud and um, use it to store all your videos or or documents or whatever um, in there. So I hope that's been helpful to you. Uh, thank you for watching. Um, my name is Karen. Um, if you need any support, then please um, reach out to me and um, and I would um, please reach out to me and I'd be more than happy to help you. Thank you.